guys, Top Pops here, and today I'm going to be doing a brand new P.O. Box opening. So let's get started. Okay guys, so I'm trying it down here so that way I can kind of show you stuff a little bit easier. And this is just one of the packages to give you an example here. So I can just kind of lift it up a bit and if I need to I can just, you know, get everything a bit easier. But I think we're going to try the camera a bit lower today so that way we can, um, you know, it's a bit easier for everyone really. But I want to go through all of this stuff. So today we have 11 letters and... How many packages? It was a big one because I hadn't gone for about a week and a couple of days. So 11 letters and one, two, three, four, five, five packages. Two of the ones that I got I opened up in yesterday's video because one of them uh, was from a guy on Instagram who's really cool. He makes a bunch of like pins and buttons and stuff. I'll give you an example here if you guys want to go check out that video. This is one of them. Um, but he does a lot of really cool stuff over there. So you guys can go check out that video if you guys want to go see that. And then we've got a bunch of letters from around the world and stuff like that. Some bigger ones, some smaller ones. Um, but let's just get into the first thing here. So I think we're going to do a couple letters package, couple letters package like we normally do. Um, but let me grab some letters here because we've got some over here. This one is coming in all the way from London. Nice. Okay, guys. It says not to show address. Of course, I won't show your address on here. Um, or at least I, I try not to, but I, I do my best, which I, I usually don't. But let's see what we've got here. Oh, there's a postcard in here. Okay, so let me read the letter first, guys. Then I'll show you the postcards. Which is cool, because I don't have a postcard from London. Uh, two Top Pops. Hello, my name is Renee. Uh, I am 19 years old. I've been watching your channel since... You started. I really enjoy your content. Keep up the great work. Uh, what set of pops uh, would you like to see be made? I think The Office is the biggest one for me, really. Or, or Nintendo. I own 97 pops and I'm on my way to 100. Nice. Uh, my favorite pop um, has to be my wounded Dr. Ian Malcolm. That's, that's a good one. Um, but my favorite set is Once Upon a Time, Overwatch, Steven Universe, Big, Big Trouble in Little China, and The Fifth Element. Right now I am trying to complete the last two. Thank you for reading my letter. I hope you like the postcards. Renee. P.S. The postcards are quite old. Um, buses don't look like that anymore. Let's see, guys. So let me show them off. The buses don't look like that anymore? Huh. Anyways, guys, so here's one of them. I think there might be years on them if I can find them. Uh, I don't know. There might not be, but here's another one, guys, there. You must just have these, but these look really nice. I like these a lot. These look great. So the buses apparently don't look like that anymore? Yeah, they don't make double-decker buses anymore. Oh, that's like the staple of London, isn't it? <laughs> I don't know much about London, but I do know that it does look really nice on postcards. But anyways, thank you so much for this, Renee. Really cool. I'm trying to make the whole postcard collection bigger, and we've been doing really well lately with all the different postcards we've been getting. So everybody who's been sending them, thank you so much for that, because we have a giant pile of them, and I want to do something cool with them. I don't know what yet, but we're going to do something cool. This one's coming in from Samantha from WI, Wyoming? Hmm. This one says Top Pops. Hey, more postcards. Wow. Dear Top Pops, my name is Samantha. I'm from Wisconsin. Wisconsin. I thought it was Wyoming. But that's not a... St Anyways. Um, I also collect Funko Pops. I started about two years ago. I have over a hundred of them, and I keep getting more. My biggest set I have is the Stranger Things Pops. I got about 27 of them. I found your YouTube page a few months ago, and I like your unboxing videos. And all the new pops you get. I really enjoy when you do the Pop Hunt videos. You like postcards from all over the place. So I have 30 of them... Uh, three of them, sorry, from you... Uh, for you from Wisconsin. One is a uh, Lam Lambeau Field, uh, where the Green Bay Packers play. Uh, f uh, the other is of cows because we have lots of farmland here. Also, look at the postcard closely. Can you see a duck in the picture? And the last one is the different places you can go in uh, Wisconsin. Sorry, WI, Wisconsin. I hope you enjoy them. P.S. Sorry for my crappy handwriting, Samantha. Hey, no, it looks good. And it's got the nice little top pops on the front there. That's really cool as well. Let me show off the ones here, guys. If you can find the duck, I'll put it in post if I remember where the duck is. Um, I'll, I'll probably take a while to find it, but if you guys can find the duck, put it in the comment section below. Um, also, guys, here is um, another one from Wisconsin. Well, they're all from there. And then this is the Lambeau Field. I think it's Lambeau. I think so. Lambo? Lambeau Field? Anyways, that looks really cool as well. So now we, we got five guys and two letters there. Five guys. Hmm, good restaurant. Um, but that is really cool. And uh, yeah, thank you so much for this. Nice. Now on to the next one here. This one's coming in from Tyler from the U.S. I don't know. Oregon? 
Morgan? No. Open on camera, please. Of course I'll open it on camera. Okay, now let's see if I can get into this. Might need scissors for this one. This one is one, of, like sometimes it's just easier to cut them than open them up like real letters, I find. Um, ah, da, 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 da. There we go, ta-da. Okay, so, ooh, this one looks good. Gotta get this out. I, I, always, I always hate it when I accidentally rip them. Anyways, point is, I didn't know. I didn't, Tyler, I didn't. Uh, Dear Top Hops, my name is Tyler. I'm nine years old. I live in Oregon. I got it right. I've been watching you for about a month, and you have inspired me to uh, collect pops. In my collection, I have the Cuphead Devil and Neighbor Pumpkin Head. Uh, yours truly, Tyler. Thanks, Tyler. And you guys can see down there a little Top Pops drawing, too. It's really nice. I like that. It's cool. Thank you so much for that. Now, let's get into a package here, guys, because we've done three letters. Um, let me do this smaller one that we have here. This one's coming in from Michael, or Hop on Pops. I've heard that name before. Anyways, guys, here's a little package here. Uh, it's easier. I think I can just cut down here, if I'm not mistaken. I should be able to get it. Uh, yeah, nice. Okay, that was easy. Whew. Okay, so let me read the letter here first. Um... Then I'll show you guys what's in here. Uh, my name is Michael, and I have been watching Top Pops for the past few months. I've been enjoying your channel and all the cool stuff you do in it, from pop hunts, just talking with us about pops, and other things. I started collecting Funko Pops back in 2014 when I got my first pop from Disney Points Rewards. The one that I got was Rocket Raccoon, one who happens to be my favorite Marvel character. Nice. Um, I now own around 85 pops, which is six being chases. My favorite pop to collect is anime, but I also love collecting of tons of other Disney, Marvel movies, video games, and more. I'm not into sports ones, though. I am kind of. I like the hockey ones and maybe the mascots from baseball, but other than that, I mean, they all kind of look the same in pop form. I wanted to. I wanted to let you know that you've inspired me to make my own channel that's named Hop on Pops. Um, I would love it if you could check out my channel and let me know what you think of it. I wanted to send you a small package of stuff I just had laying around and thought you might like. Also, in the image above, I made editing several um, images only together to online to try to make what my dream pop would be like. It is to Tokiomi, Tokioami with Dark Shadow from My Hero Academia. Academia. I'll show you guys in a second. I was wondering uh, what your dream pop to someday get made is. Or have they already made it? Also, could you give a shout out to my channel? Yes, guys, go check out Hop on Pops. Um, Dream Pop, uh, maybe a Top Pops Pop. No, I'm kidding. Um, I don't know. I guess it was kind of Atom Bomb. I really wanted Garbage Pail Kids ones and they made them. So Atom Bomb is a really cool one. Um, I don't know. They've all made, they've made so many Pops, guys. If, if I have something, I'd come back to you on that one. Here's the one that he, he made up here, which looks pretty cool. And yeah, guys, so go check out Hop on Pops. We'll see what he's got in this package here. Uh, ooh, it's all bubble wrap. Nice. Oh, hey, look at this. A Batman Pez. That's cool. You guys got to know I love Batman and Pez. Can't go wrong with this. Bouncy ball. Hope that'll focus. Just an orange bouncy ball. Not bad. What else? We, what's this one here? This one, I feel, oh, is this... um? Oh, that's cool. This is one of the... 101 Dalmatians, which is pretty cool. Little Disney uh, figure there. That's really nice, actually. I like figures, you know what I mean? When they're like little ones like this. Uh, it's kind of cool to see like the nice detail they have on these. This is Black Manta, if I'm not mistaken. I think it is. It looks like it. I think so. I believe so. Yeah, Black Manta. It says it right on it. Nice, I got it. Uh, what's this one here? Ooh. This is, I'm not going to pretend like I know the name, this is Changeling, Changeling, if I'm not mistaken, I think that's what it says on it. Let's see if it'll focus. Pretty cool. I like the detail on these things, they look really cool. Uh, what's this one here? Ooh, is this a, uh, yes, yeah, a Funko, this would be a Mimoji of Rocket Raccoon. Nice. These, honestly, this is some pretty cool stuff here. Ooh, hey, this is cool. This is a Deadshot pin from the DC Legion of Collectors. This is probably from the Suicide Squad box, if I'm not mistaken. I never got this box, so it's pretty cool to have this one now. There it is there. Now we also have a bunch of cards from, what are these ones from? These ones are Full Metal Alchemist ones. I guess I'll just show them off, guys. I don't really know what they're from. It looks like there's a stack of them in each one, so that's pretty cool. 
Uh, I'm not going to go through all of them right now, but oh, I like that one there. I'm not going to go through all of them, but uh, they do look really cool. Here's a cool one. These ones are cool because they're Looney Tunes. And there's stuff on the back of them too, like comics and that, I think. Yeah, they look really cool actually. Here's another one. What's this bottom thing here? This thing looks cool. I'll show you in a second, guys. There's this one. And then there's this too. Doctor Doom hologram card. It's from 1991. Whoa. Let me show you this, guys. Can you guys even see that? It's so holographic. Look at that. That's cool. And I'll show you the back, guys, so you can see that it is Doctor Doom. That thing's really cool. This one's neat. I like this. I mean, I like all of them, but this one. Ooh. There's also a Suicide Squad um, patch here. I will be opening up the pack of cards that you sent as well, which is the Kung Fu Panda ones. And then there's these from uh, Vanguard, Vanguard, if I'm not mistaken. There's a big pile of them here. But let's open up the Kung Fu Panda cards, guys, because it looks like it's uh, you taped it closed. Now, it might not be Kung Fu Panda cards in here because it's just taped closed, but there probably is, if I'm, uh, if I, yeah, it looks like it. Looks like you got a full pack here. Ooh. Hey, hey, these are cool. Ooh, there's cutout cards. Sorry, I should be showing you guys these, but uh, I just wanted to look through them first. So they're Kung Fu Panda 2 cards. And uh, they look pretty cool. Look at that. Boom. Hey, hey. Anyways, guys. Thank you so much for this package. Just all of this stuff is really cool. And, uh... They'll go nice. I'll find spots for all of it, but let's move on to the next one that we've got here because we've got a bunch of packages we got to go through and especially a bunch of letters. And I want to make sure that I get everything in videos. I always feel bad. If, I never want to not put something in a video. Do you know what I mean? If I ever get a package, I always want to make sure I show it off and say like, hey, I got this and that I really like it and everything and thank you for it, you know? So we got to get everything here, guys. But let's do another three letters. Yeah, let's do another three. Okay, so... This one's coming in from California. Hmm. Fragile, must be Italian. Hmm. That's such a funny one. Everybody gets mad when I say it. If you don't know what the reference is, usually people will get mad about it, but it's from uh, A Christmas Story, if you guys didn't know. Let's see what we got here. Okay. Dear Tristan, I am nine years old. Uh, my name is Noah, and I've been watching your videos since this January. I have ten, 11 pops, sorry, 11 pops, which are Dancing Groot, uh, B Dominion, Bendy, Cat in the Hat, Luke Skywalker, 8 Bit Raphael, Harry Potter, Ron Weasley, Steve in uh, Gold Armor, and Death Star Droid. Black. Nice. Hope you heard. Uh, hope you heard that they are making more Walgreens exclusives. They are the Lizard and Silk, both from Marvel. Yeah, I heard about that one. This is pretty recent then. Um, sorry, I can't give you a pop. Completely fine. Nobody needs to send pops. But I, uh, I love your channel. Sincerely, yours, Noah. P.S. I also have ARG and do... And to... Do you have the Miguel Chase pop figure? P Miguel, I do not. No, I don't. I wish I did, but I don't. Uh, what, what do we got going on here? St oh, nice. Star Wars. Bye, buddy. Hope you find your dad. SpongeBob underwater. It's a cool drawing there. Nice. Thanks so much for this, Noah. Now, let's move on to the next one here. Ooh, those are some big stamps. Let me see if I can show those off, guys. Look at that. From Canada. I've never seen a stamp that big. Hmm. They're huge. Anyways, let's move on to this one here. They look like King Tut. Are they? When King Tut came to the ROM? Yeah, it is. I'm on top of things. I went to that. I did go to that. The Royal Ontario Museum. I went. Is that what it's called? Yeah. I went to that when it was in, uh, when it was at the ROM. Funny, huh? Let's see what we've got here. That was before the YouTube channel, if I'm not mistaken. Um, Dear Top Pops, my name is Patrick. I live in a small town in Ontario called Holstein. I've been collecting pops for a few years and recently started watching your YouTube videos around this time last year. I only have 33 Funko Pops right now, but my collection is growing slowly, and I hope to buy a lot more this summer. I only have one chase, which is the Riddler chase from Batman 60's TV show. I really enjoy your po watching your pop hunting videos, as well as your P.O. Box openings. I'm really into horror, and I would love to see if you made a pop hunt specifically for horror pops. Yeah, maybe. I never really thought about it. 
Thank you for being an awesome YouTuber. Whenever you upload a video, I automatically stop whatever I am doing and watch it. I always know that your videos are going to be amazing because your videos are always so awesome and well put together. Thank you for inspiring me to collect more pops. I can't wait to see more videos this year. All the best, Patrick. Thanks, Patrick, so much for this letter. Yeah, that's so funny that it's from the ROM. Let me see if, uh, what? Yeah, it was, n oh, so it was ROM Museum 1941 to 2014. I think that was the time that it was there? I know that sounds too long. But I know we did go to see um, King Tut and all that stuff, so that would have been cool. Yeah, they must have had those stamps there or something. I don't know. Now let's get into this one here. This one is from Derek from California. Nice. Let's see if I can get into this. Um, here we go. That, that was an easy one. Hey, that was not bad. Okay, let's see what we got going on here. Ooh, a sticker. Hey, hey, I'll show you guys the sticker in a second. Uh, dear, dear Top Pops, I'm so, oh, this is in Disney font, this could take a bit. I'm so excited you, uh, to have finally gotten the opportunity to write you a, le you, to you, sorry. You have put, um, s s you have put much enthusiasm, passion, and creativity in your work. Uh, what sets are, what sets you apart from most YouTubers that produce Funko content is that, is the fact that you reach out to your audience every day. Sorry, Y's look like T's and T's look like Y. I'll show you in a second. Besides me, I know everybody appreciates your consistency. Thank you. And I hope everyone understands how truly difficult that it can be to produce content every day, especially two like we're doing right now. Um, and another thing that I have noticed is that you is your support system that you have when it comes to your channel. It is absolutely amazing to see how well your family takes your interest and helps you succeed in the way that you do. I'm sure you know that every channel has their reoccurring catchphrases that they try to uh, they try and make it their own. I feel like yours are genuinely the best phrases, such as "So let's get started." And this has been another episode of Top Pops. Thanks for watching. And finally, your outros are great to see in every episode that you make. I've seen your interest in Disney and hope that you take the opportunity to follow my account on Instagram, Pop Magic Fun. Yeah, I'll check it out. The account focuses on the cross, uh, crossover between Funko Pops, pins, and the concept of Disney. As a fellow pop collector, please consider sharing my username on your show in order to help build a generous amount of followers on to my account. Hey guys, so go check out Pop Magic Fun. Uh, thank you for thank you for your time, and I hope that you have another magical day of filmmaking. Uh, Derek, aka Pop Magic. P.S. I thought I'd give you a different sticker that most people do not have. The explanation of the sticker can be found on the Instagram account. So here is the sticker, guys, that you have to get from Disney, I'm guessing. Um, but that's really cool. Huh. One time when we went to Disney, I got a sticker from a lady in downtown Disney that said, Happy Unbirthday. I thought that one was pretty funny because it wasn't our birthday. She's like, oh, I got a perfect one. And she pulled out Happy Unbirthday. Anyways, guys, let's get into the next package that we have here, which I want to show off. Let's go with this one here, guys. This one looks pretty cool. Um, I don't want to show the front, but this is from John from GA, Georgia, I want to say. Yeah, let's say Georgia. Um, but let's get into this one, guys. Let me see if I can get into this. I got, these ones are usually easier to get into. There we go. Uh, ooh, okay, okay. Let's see what we got here. So, <gasps> more postcards. Hey, hey, everybody's sending postcards. Which was this one? This is a cool postcard. Look at that, guys. Now that's a postcard. Is there a letter in here? I should probably get to that before I get to everything in here. I feel bad whenever I open everything up first. Uh, I don't want to show addresses. Um, I don't see a letter, I don't think. But there is some cool stuff in here, guys. Maybe it's written on the back of one of these? No. Hmm. Anyways, here is Atlanta, Georgia. I was right with the Georgia one. Atlanta, Georgia here. Then we have another one from Atlanta. That one's pretty cool. We have this one, Georgia. Maybe one day, guys, we'll do a postcard collection video. That could be cool. If you guys want to see that, let me know. We'll do it on the second channel. And then we have this Georgia one, too, which is really neat. Awesome. These are some really cool postcards. i got to get a good spot to put all of them now, you know? Get a nice one area. Uh, but let's show off the two things that he sent. So let's do this one first, because then there's a mystery menu in here that I want to do. Uh, Boston Creative Company. So guys, that's it here. I thought, is, what is this? I wonder what it could be. It looks like it could be like an unboxing knife or something. I don't know, let's just get into this. Let's check it out. Oh my gosh. Guys, it's a spoon and on the spoon it says, no soup for you. Where is it, right? I wanna show it off nicely. It 
says, no soup for you. If anybody knows what that's from, it is a reference from um, Seinfeld when he goes to the soup Nazi, uh, which is really funny. And uh, that's such an awesome spoon. I gotta keep this in, in a good spot now because that thing's really funny. And it's, I, I, I'm never gonna wanna use this spoon and I'm not gonna use this spoon because it's, it's honestly really cool. Like, what? What? That's so cool and random. We've been watching Seinfeld a lot too recently. I've probably mentioned it a couple times, but yeah, that's, that's really awesome. I wish I got a name for this. All I know is it's John. Um, but this guy, this guy here is really cool because this is the Garbage Pail Kids. Tops and Funko make these. These are mystery minis. I guess we can show these ones off because this is from 2016, Tops Company, looks like. This is Series 2, though, so I don't know if this came out in 2016, but probably did. Um, but let's get into this one, guys. These are really big mystery minis because these things are huge. But honestly, guys, th these things are awesome. I got to get more mystery minis. Okay, so let's see what we got here. Ah, make sure it's something good. I'm not going to feel it, guys. I'm just going to open it. They're all 1 in 12. Let me show you what it is on the back here, guys. They're all 1 in 12, so it's not like anything's rare or anything. But if I were to get one, let's see. Kim Kong, Fry and Ryan, maybe Buggy Betty would be cool. I don't know. All of them are really awesome, so it wouldn't really matter. But, uh, hey, this one's cool. Okay, let me figure out the name of this one. This is Richie Wretched. Ooh, look at that. That's cool. I think the vomit really makes this one. That's cool. Well, John, thank you so much for all of this stuff. Too bad there was no letter in there. But uh, thank you so much for this stuff, guys. It's really cool. And um, some really awesome stuff that you guys are always sending. So thank you so much for this. Uh, but let's, get, let's do the last two letters here. And then there are bigger, thicker packages as well. But we'll do those ones after the packages. But let's see what we got here, guys. So this one, kind of get into this one here. This letter, got it. Okay, so this pa this letter um, is coming in from... Wait, let's find out where this is coming from first. It's from Funko Doug from Florida. Okay, so, hello Top Pops. We love your videos and wanted to send you fan mail. I was the one who donated and made your brother dab for two minutes on the live stream. We are starting a YouTube channel and would love if you would give us a shout out. Our channel is called Funko Dog. Oh, Funko Dog. I thought it said Funko Doug. Sorry, Funko Dog. Go check him out, guys. Um, we are doing a potential giveaway at 300 subs for the Enchanted Tiki Room 2-pack. I hope you also enjoy the pictures from Funko Dog. <laughs> oh, look at these guys. These are so funny. Look at that. <laughs> Those look so good. It's actually like, I'm looking at the camera, guys. It's focusing on this because it thinks it's a face it's that good. I like that Tiki Room 2-pack on the, on the right there, too. Giveaway at 300 subs, guys. Yeah, if you guys want a Tiki Room 2-pack and you missed out on it, guys, go subscribe to them. That's really cool. There's also another drawing in here. Whoa. Look at this. It's got watercolor on it and everything like that too. Whoa, that's nice. I like the sweater on it too, because I have that sweater. I have that sweater. Oh, that's cool. Anyways, thank you so much for this. Really cool. Yeah, guys, go subscribe to Funko Dog. That was some amazing drawings right there. Now, what's on the back of this one? Oh, sorry, I dropped it. This one is coming in from New York. And uh, it doesn't have a name on it, but let's see. Guys, it's got on Batman there. And is that SpongeBob and then Jack-Jack? I think that's SpongeBob. Or it might be, I don't know. I guess, I guess we'll have to find out. Maybe, I can't tell who it is. I'm not sure. Anyways, let's see what we got inside of here too. This says, Bruce Wayne, Batman, Tristan, Top Pops. Okay. Hi Tristan, my brother and I have been watching your channel for a few months and are subscribed. We currently have about 60 pops. Our channel is bperk3, please subscribe. Rogan and Derek. We do not have many videos, but if you subscribe, then we will make more. Thank you, Rogan and Derek. Bye buddy, hope you find your dad. Roll the clip. Noah, Christmas 2017. That was when, when, uh, when th what was it? We had a, my mom bought me a sweater that said, bye buddy, hope you find your dad. And I was so excited about it. And then right when I pulled it out, I said, bye, buddy, hope you find your dad. Then in the background, Noah yells, roll the clip. And then right after that, I started it because he knew it was coming. Well, that's so cool that you actually remember that from like a long time ago. But let's get into the, let's get into this package here, guys. This one looks good. This one here is, let me see if I can get this here. This one's from New Jersey. It says fragile on it, which is nice. It usually means it came in good condition. Uh, $5 postage, that's not bad from New Jersey. Well, here's the thing, it's New Jersey to New York, so it's not even that far. But, uh, 
Yeah, let's see what this could be. You never know, guys. You never know. It's not it's not a huge package, but it's it's a good size. Oh, there's, I gotta get this cut on the side here. I missed one. Uh, let me see what we've got here. I don't want to cut my finger because I always seem to. You know how many times I've cut my finger? I just don't tell you guys about it. Okay, so it says, read letter first. Oh, there's a coin in here too. Okay, is this the letter? Read this first. Okay, there is also something on the bottom here that I'm probably gonna have to read. Okay, so, um, hi Top Pops, my name is Chad and I'm 12 years old, almost 13. <laughs> um, I li uh, live, uh, sorry, li oh gosh, this is incursive. Love watching your videos for a while. I've been watching your videos for a while, for a couple of months and I'm a huge fan. I started collecting pops over a year ago and I have 63 in my collection. 64 if you consider the Rocket and Groot 2 pack. I would consider that, yeah. Um, I have to be two separate, I have two of the two separate pops, including five chases. My most valuable and favorite pop is Homer Simpson. I got it from a toy show here in New Jersey. All you have, um, do you have the chance, um, I, th wait, New Jersey. If you have the chance, I think you should go pop hunting in New Jersey. We have a lot of great, th uh, we have a lot of stores that sell pops, including some shops that have really rare grails for reasonable prices. Along with their letter, along with the letter, I've also sent you some uh, pixel art on the pop logo, a New Jersey quor uh, a New Jersey quarter, and a pop that you can only get in stores in New Jersey unless you buy it online. You can now look at the pop and turn to the back. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I gotta look at the pop first because he's got more written on it after on the back. And then there is something at the bottom here too. So this is the coin. Let's get into the coin guys first before we actually get inside of it. But it's cool because he's from New Jersey and then he sent the coin or the quarter from New Jersey. Let me see if it'll focus better. Mm. The quarter from New Jersey. You know guys said so they have one for every state. That's a cool little touch. Why won't it focus? Come on, it's my face, I know it is. There we go, guys. That's the one side. Now, what year is this from? This is from... 1999. Nice. Okay, so, let's see what we've got here. So, now look at the pop. I'm not gonna look at the letter yet. No! Really? What? Oh, this is cool. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, guys. I gotta show you this. I'm gonna start reading the letter, and as I'm reading it, I'm gonna slowly put the pop up. Boom, big reveal. This pop is the Jay and Silent Bob Secret Stash exclusive Kevin Smith. I managed to pick up two from the store and decided to send one to you. I hope you keep um, collect. I hope you keep creating awesome content for us popsters and keep an eye out for uh, fragile letters from me in the future. Best wishes, Chad. Read the read this first. Oh, sorry, that was folded. But look at this, guys. This is the Kevin Smith I don't have. Now, you know what's really cool about this is the secret stash place in New Jersey. I want to go to that store so bad. This thing's amazing. Thank you so much for this, Chad. You did not have to do this at all. Now I've got both of them. Or is there a third one, too? Oh, is there a third one? I was thinking I'd have all of the Kevin Smith ones now. Ah, I need one more. Oh, dang. Anyways, but this is such an amazing package. Now, there is something at the bottom here, too. Let me see what this is. Hey, Pop Pixel Art. It says, um, if you're wondering how I made this, I put the normal pop logo through a computer program to make it uh, pixelated. Then I had to color everything piece by piece. Oh, sorry. Every pixel one by one. Sorry. Approximate time it took to finish is two and a half hours. Whoa. That's some dedication right there. Thanks so much for this. It's pretty cool. Looks pixelated and everything. I like it. Anyways, thank you so much, Chad, for that. That is that is over the top. You did not have to do that at all. Seriously, honestly, just a letter would have made me happy, honestly. It looks great, though. Thank you so much for this. If you're wondering, came in great condition. I know sometimes people like to ask that. Um, yeah, the Kevin Smith came in great condition. I like how you can see the store on the back there as well. I think that's really cool. Yeah. But anyways, thank you so much for this. Now, let's move on to the next thing that we have here. We've got three kind of thicker ones here. Let's do these ones all together, I guess. Uh, yeah, this shouldn't be too bad. I'm just kind of looking to see what it is. This one. Ha ha. Ooh, nice. What is this one here? It says, bye, buddy. Hope you find your dad. <laughs> 
That's pretty cool. And then there is a TP logo. Is that it? No letter? Hmm. No letter in here? It's always nice when there's a letter. Okay guys, so we have the Top Pop signature card right here. I will again be working on that. I can finally do those because it is the summer, so maybe I'll do them this week. Um, let me read the letter though. Hi Top Pops, my name is Raymond and I am 11 years old. I live in Puerto Rico. Whoa, nice. Um, I started watching your channel last year. I started watching your channel last year because, I, because a hurricane came called Maria. I was bored because we had no light and no water. That's when I started watching your channel. You made me so happy and inspired me to collect Funko Pops. I have 13 Pops and 3 Dorbs. I have an order um, on, in on Amazon that has these Pops. Uh, Spider-Man from Spider-Man Homecoming, Thor from Thor Ragnarok, Black Panther from Black Panther, Thanos from Infinity War, Atom Bomb from GPK. I also sent you a card um, that you need to sign. No worries, you don't have to pay anything. I got you covered. Sorry for all the liquid paper. The liquid paper? Oh, it's fine. Uh, but then there's also this in here. Oh, okay, so yeah, he's got the thing on it with the postage and everything. Perfect, yeah, I'll send that little card out for you for sure. Unless you want one of the bigger cards, and let me know. Um, but yeah, I can do this for sure. Nice, thank you so much for this. Yeah, I'll work on, I'm working on the signatures. I'm working on it. Don't worry. Um, but yeah, that is a really nice letter you got there. Thank you so much for that. Sorry to hear about the hurricane, too, huh? But at least the video's brought your spirits up. Now, let's see what we've got here. So this one is... Just has my name on it. Nothing on the... Nothing on it. Let's see what we got here. We gotta go from this side. Well, you never know. And when they do them in these bigger ones, usually it means that there's, like, something thicker, like a piece of paper in it. So, like a full piece of paper. Uh, Woohoo! Hey, what do we got here? Is there anything else in here? Nope. This is Top Pops, best YouTuber ever. Better than Jake Paul. I'll take it. <laughs> nice. Maybe not in subscribers, but I'll say in uh, consistency. Dear Top Pops, I am your biggest fan. I have a total of 36 Pops. My favorite line is the Scooby-Doo Pops. I have all of them now, so thanks to you guys, I got them all. I would love to win your 10-inch pour giveaway. You were the one who inspired me to buy Pops. I hope you have a good day from Derek. Thanks, Derek, for this nice, awesome letter. Uh, plus, guys, yeah, th that giveaway will be happening. We're doing a giveaway for my birthday, which will be, we'll probably announce it on July 13th or close to. But yeah, that one will be coming. Uh, what's this one? This one's from Sergio. Nice. From Texas. So let's check this one out, guys. I already opened this one up because it's a little bit easier if I do it like that. Um, nothing else in here. This one is, oh, he sent some things that you can uh, stick to the wall. We've got this one, the penguin slash the Riddler. These are honestly really cool. Let's see if I can get this off there. This one is Wonder Woman slash Aquaman. Uh, this one is from The Last Airbender. Really cool. D Ooh, Disney Series 4 card set, which looks really cool. And then we have Prince. Nice. I'll probably put these up somewhere. I put up the ones you did last time with the little photos. Maybe if I find somewhere good to put these, I'll stick them up on the wall. But uh, yeah, that's really cool. Thank you so much for this. Sergio, you always got to write letters and stuff too, just to let me know what's going on here. Because you, you, you make some pretty cool stuff. Um, but let's move on to the last two things, which are packages. Let's do, let's do this bigger one, I guess. Let's do this big one here. Um, so this one is uh, from De Ohio. Ohio. Uh, it's got the case on there. But let's see what's inside of here, guys, because I want to want to see what we got going on here. I already cut this one too, so it's easier for me. Um, but I, I don't want to make sure I don't show any addresses because I know some people don't want to. I mean, nobody would, but let's see what we got going on here. Um, Dear Top Pops, we are big fans of your channel. Chase is 16. Uh, Chase, 16. Gavin, 13. I, I, Ireland, 8. I'm going to say that's how you pronounce it. Um, we have been watching for a few months now as a family. We have a total of 145 Pops so far. We are the main collectors of the family. But our older brother, Troy, and our mom and dad have some, too. We hope that you like the two pops that we have sent you. We also included some candy pops for you. Oh, you, uh, with your name on them. Are they top pops? Oh, I like those. Can you please sign off the three index cards that we have included? We also, ha we also included a self-addressed stamp and envelope for you to send them back. Thank you so much. Happy hunting, Chase, Gavin, and Ireland. Thank you so much for this. Honestly, you guys did not have to do this at all, but I think... Aha, here they are. Let's see what we got here. Yeah, I've got the, there's the three cards in there. Yeah, I'll do it for sure. Why not? Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm working on them. Those ones are easy because I can just send them out even quicker. But um, let's see what we got here. Yes, they are top pops. You sent a 48 pack. What? 
I've never had this many before. Look at this. If you guys have never heard of these before, same name. I took, I didn't take the name. Don't let them know that I'm a thing because they might come at me and I might have to change it to something else. But there it is, guys. Top Pops right there. They have, hey, it's a little open. Let me grab one. They have a candy company with um, suckers like this that are called Top Pops. These are really cool. Save these for later. But there are two Pops in here. So let's see what we got going on here. So let's see. We've got two of them. Ooh, this is cool. This is one that I've wanted for a while, actually, because it hasn't, um, what, what am I trying to think of here? It hasn't been in stores that I've seen anyways recently. And um, now I just need one more to finish the set. So you are helping out my collection for this one. You guys ready for this? This is Puss and Boots. Da da da, so cool. I like this one a lot. Now all I need is Donkey and then we're good to go. Puss and Boots is so cool too. We should do top five cat Funko Pops again. I know I've already done that and you're like, what? You've already done that one. Yes, I have, but we should do it again because now I have another one. Don't mind me, I just gotta get, there's another pop in here too guys, but I'm just doing something real quick. I don't know if you guys can hear what I'm doing, but uh, now this next one that we have here is from Wonder Woman. And this is pretty cool too. This one is Hippolyte, Hippolyte, Hippolyta, I think it is. This one's really cool as well. I like the uh, the crown she's got on here. The crown on her is really cool actually. The sword looks nice. I like the gold metallic paint on it. I was trying to think about it. Even if they're more characters that are kind of obscure, not that that one's obscure or anything, but I was just thinking about it out loud. Um, even if with the characters that are just people is what I'm trying to say, Funko goes really detailed with them as well. Um, if you guys know what I mean, they go really detailed, but just like people now, like before it'd just be a head and body, but that one looks really cool and they probably could have gone even simpler if they wanted to, but I like the way they did it. They added all the gold and everything to this. Um, we've got the last one here, which is coming in from Jordan from Georgia, GA. Sounds like it. These are good. You guys should get these if you haven't had them before. Tag me in a photo if you get them on Instagram or if you have them. I've never seen them before in stores. Only when you guys send them to me, so. Oh, I gotta get this last cut. I think I'll put it upside down. I did. Sorry. <laughs> it's funny. I still open it upside down. Oh! Wait. Is there a letter in here? Hold on. There we go. I wonder if there's a letter in here. I should probably be getting the letter first, but... What? No! Chase Batman. What? No! Who's this from? Now I gotta figure this out. Oh good, there's a letter. Okay. I feel bad pulling it out first. Dear Top Pops, my name is Jordan, I'm 20 years old. I'm sending you this pop because while I was on eBay pop hunting, I came across it. The pop reminded me of your channel and it was a steal of a price. I really hope you don't have it already. I do, but I, I love this thing. I enjoy your channel a lot. One of the main reasons I got on YouTube since finding it a couple of months ago. Your collection is really inspiring. I personally have about 310 pops and probably won't be getting too many more. Only the ones I find really amazing. If you don't mind a question, if anyone has given you grief over your collection and growing over the size, how do you handle it? I don't. It's more so giving grief about what it looks like in here, like the mess usually. If you guys know, like from doing P.O. Box videos, everything just gets thrown on the ground. But it's not so much the pops. The family seems to be against me collecting much of anything is why I ask. Well, to wrap things up, thank you for your thank, thank you for the commitment you have to your channel. I'm sure all of your fans appreciate it. Have a good day, a fan, Jordan. Jordan, thank you so much for this. I already have this one, but I'm not complaining because I love this pop. And uh, maybe we could do something cool with it because I already do have it. And I don't just want to have two of the same Chase one. You know what I mean? And last time I was sent a double chase, I gave one away at Niagara Falls Comic Con. That was cool. If you're watching, congratulations to that one. He was a really cool kid that won that one. 
But yeah, guys, here is Batman Robot. Uh, really cool pop. So glad that you sent this one over because it's such an awesome character. And um, that you got it for a steal on eBay, that's even better. Also, guys, if you would like to see um, a postcard collection video on the second channel, let me know because maybe I can do one. Um, but yeah, this was an amazing P.O. Box opening. We got a lot of really cool stuff. So thank you guys to everyone that sent something. And um, yeah, just an amazing box of stuff. Like you guys are really cool with the fan mail and I love how you guys sent all this amazing stuff. And I know you guys find these enjoying, so thank you so much for this guys. But anyways, if anybody wants to send anything, letters, packages, you know, postcards, it's in the description down below. You guys can check it out there. Top Pops is the business name. Yes, I somehow snagged that one. I know for new people, if you're wondering, that is the business name. But anyways, guys, this has been another episode of Top Pops Popsters. Thanks for watching. Hey,